Oh, did I steal some eggs? <laughs> Alright everyone, welcome back to Cody's lab. So, I'm in the Honda again. Uh, currently at Chicken Hole. I've got my chicks in the car. You can see they're in this box here. And it is impossible to sleep in when you've got the chickens in the car because they get up at the crack of morning. <laughs> they want out. Alright chickies, come on. Breakfast is served. <laughs> so a lot of people uh, recommended that I not park on grass because the catalytic converter can be hot and start a fire. And I say, excellent advice. I'm definitely taking it. So you can see I'm not parked on grass this time. So yeah, this is actually the third day I've spent out here. In fact, uh, third episode with the coyotes. The coyotes would have been like right over here. The last uh, two nights have been much better though. <laughs> they love running around catching grasshoppers. At least trying to. <laughs> See if I can help them out. These chicks kind of just follow me around. I'm gonna see if I can walk them up the hill. Come on, chick chicks. See if it fits. Okay, I'll take it back. Let's go. There you go. There you go. There's your friends. Yeah, somebody drove through here, so this was not me. And they did it when it was raining, or at least the ground was wet, so the grass is going to be damaged like this potentially for years. I am not happy about it. Guess I need to get some signs up or something. Come on, guys. This grass is really interesting, and I've noticed the chicks have been eating it. It's almost like oats, but smaller. I wonder if I could domesticate this. Actually use it as a grain. Yeah, they eat it. There's a Mormon cricket right there. Let's see what they do. Do 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 do
There they go. Hey, chick chicks. What I got? Some treats. Oh, you're the one that don't like this. <laughs> so, Chicken Hole Base now officially has chickens. <laughs> I think that's fitting. So, uh, I have another reason for having the chickens, and that is that a chicken produces a lot more CO2 per unit mass than a human does. So I really only need a few chickens to recreate the amount of CO2 that I would be putting out. So if I'm gone, away from the base, I could have the chickens as a CO2 generator simulating me still being there. At least that's my justification. Unfortunately, not all of these chickens are going to be able to stay with me. Uh, since I hatched them from egg, half of them are roosters, and I can only have one rooster. If I have more than one, they'll just fight each other to the death. So I'm probably gonna have to rehome a couple of them. I'm not sure which ones I'm gonna do that with yet. You know, I kind of wanted to pick my rooster. You know, I have the one that's uh, most protective of the chickens and you know nicest to me. Hey bud, want some more? There you go. <laughs> It's almost scary how much they like eating meat. <laughs> but it makes sense, they are descended from raptors. Want some more? Go. <laughs> I'm sure I'll have no trouble finding homes for them. My uh, farmer friends are always wanting to know if I've got a spare rooster because uh, when you buy chicks from the store, they don't come with roosters, so there's kind of a market for them. <laughs> hey, well you want more, don't you? You're a hungry little butt. Here, go nuts. Boy, it's too big. Anyway, hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Well, I think it's time we do at least a little bit of digging. This rock's pretty soft and relatively easy to dig through, but I'm gonna need a bigger pick. That'll do.